All right, so let's see Ferris wheel on CSS problem set. Uh, there are n children who want to go on a Ferris wheel and our task is to find gondola for each child. Each gondola may have one or two children in it and in addition, the total weight in gondola should not exceed X. Okay, so here is the Ferris wheel. And for those who don't know gondola, these are gondolas where we sit and enjoy our ride. So the maximum allowed number of children is two and the total weight in gondola should not exceed x. We need to find what is the minimum number of gondolas needed for the children. We will be given with number of children, let's say example four, and then the to um, maximum weight allowed, that is 10, and then the children weights, seven to three, nine. okay. So here is the weight, we need to minimize the number of gondolas. So that means we maximize the efficiency uh, by filling out the best possible weights for the best possible weight in the gondolas so one we can do is we try to fit one light and one heavy weight children and then make a pair one as uh, max allowed pair is two right max allowed uh, is two so we are going to make a pair of one light and one heavy so this way we can fill out the children and if suppose uh, if by combining this we are not getting that means the weight is exceeding 10 weight is exceeding the given limit so we 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 remove this heavy one and we'll try to fit the next smaller heavy one right let's for example this these are the weights given this is one weight one weight one weight one weight so we are making pair here so suppose we make the first light and one heavy one so one heavy one is here let's say so if suppose this pair is getting uh, exceeded the is uh, exceeding the weight so we go on to the next heavier one and then that means this one won't combine with anyone so we get rid of this that means we we need to find one heavy and light so we can do is sorting we sort in ascending order then the left portion would contains the le less heavier child and the right one will contain more heavier child so this way we can segregate the light and heavy one so as this example i have sorted it out two three seven nine now as told we will make the pair let's this is one this is uh, we'll start from here so let's call let's make this pointer as i and the other pointer will be standing here now we make the pair 2 plus 9 and we'll check is it smaller with the max allowed 10 no right this is 11 so this is not a smaller so we get rid get rid of this heavy one so we'll move the pointer here and since we have uh, moved the pointer up, this, uh, moved this pointer here, that means that means this 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 weight this child has to go alone, right? Because it can't combine with any other children. It can't be it can't be settled with other children. That that therefore this this has to go in separate single gondola single gondola right because this can't be combined with anyone and the max is two so we can fill either one children or two children we can do this right because they have said no one or two so this has to go with a single gondola because it can't combine with in lighter one all right so we have to get a win one gondola for this all right so our win one gondola count is one now our pointer is here now we can try to combine this 7 plus 2 will be 9 it is less than 10 right so this can go so this pair can go our j was here i was here this pair can go so will now the count will become 2 and since this is this has gone so we'll move here the pointer will move here and then this pointer also move here now we are standing at i and j again 
since they both are same so for this gondola we are at here right three so we will uh, settle this with we will uh, increase the count again because i s j and same so this has to go so we have three gondolas now now uh, since i and j are equal that means we have we have seen all the children so our stopping condition will be when i becomes when i is less than equal to j so we will when uh, j exceed uh, when i exceeds the j we will stop so i hope it is clear what we are doing we are taking these two light and heavy and how we are segregated by doing the sorting operation and then we are trying to uh, combine them make the pair if uh, it is less than the weight well and good we will increase i and j if it is not if it is not then we will simply increase uh, decrease the j will decrease the j and will not increase the i but when they are uh, where that they can simply go in one gondola then we will increase i and decrease j okay so let's write the code of this and we will have a better understanding there so we will have the number of children first as n equal to 0 and uh, x is 0 so this is the number of children and the maximum allowed weight then we'll input this now we need to uh, create the vector for this right for the weight array or vector anything we can create so let's create vector for the weights of the children so let's create a vector of int and let's call it w that means our weight we can write weight also and since uh, Eight dot push back input. And we have not created input, so let's create input. And everything is less than ten to the power nine, and so yeah, int can go. So this is our input. And first thing we need to solve this. So weight dot begin to weight dot end now we'll initialize the pointer this is the this is taking care of light and the heavier one is taken care by this pointer which is at the last and we'll create a counter also for our gondolas so here is the counter now we need to stop when i is less than when i exceeds j so we need to keep on going and when y i is less than j now what we need to do first we need to check if weight of i plus weight of j is less than the allowed difference which is x if it is this then if if it is less than this so in the case of this let's when we i and j is here their weight sorry, in 9 is less than 10 so that means we can mm, we can fill them and we can move ahead so i plus plus and j minus minus and in, and uh, simultaneously we are going to increase the counter also because these can fill so count increase i plus plus j minus minus okay but if it is not else that means what we need to do we need to do things in the example which was here i and j was here and the combined weight is 11 which is not less than 10 so we need to decrease the j means j minus minus and we increase the counter because this uh, this child has to go on a separate gondola it can't be paired so we will say that increase the count and decrease the, the power pointer 
that's how we need to do and at the end we need to just display the count all right so we are done let's submit this and see it's working all right it's accepted 